What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite home girl, Gossip Girl. So I just want to come in with a different video this morning. You know, I was thinking about this for a couple of days now. And I said, well, let me just share with y'all. You know, let me just have a little Friday chit chat and just tell you what's going on with, in my mind. Okay, how I'm feeling these days. Sometimes I need somebody to vent to. Okay, so I'm going to choose y'all today. <clears throat> you know what I hate about some of these YouTubers? I hate the fact that when they first started out, they grabbing your attention. Now, as for me, I used to watch a few vloggers, right? And they used to put out some good content. You know, I used to enjoy watching them. And some would have a schedule of Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And some would come on like maybe two days a week, um, you know, or maybe once a week. But you saw regular uploads from them. So you know their schedules. But it seemed like as soon as they get up there, you know, past maybe a hundred thousand, past two hundred thousand. When they hit the millions and stuff like that, you see less and less and less. Now I understand that maybe you know they got some little stuff going on behind the scenes. Which get your paper, get your money. I'm not even saying you get your money. You know I'm not stressing about that. But at least you know let let your audience know what you're doing. Don't just go be ghost on them. And that's what I hate. I hate when they just ghost you and you got to figure out, well, are they coming back? Are they not coming back? You know, what's going on? And then they'll make a video saying they coming back, but they just don't know when they coming back. And it's like, okay, you grabbed our attention. You got, we, we got you where you need to be. And now this is how you treat us, which is it's messed up. And I'm not saying they can't have a life outside of YouTube. Of course you do. Everybody has a life outside of YouTube. But you have an audience as well. Now, if you came to your audience and said, okay, you know what? I can't, we can't do three, three times a week or two times a week anymore because we got stuff going on that we can't talk about right now. Then that's one thing. And, or they say we got stuff going on right now. And we'll get back to you, but we could at least do maybe once or twice, once a week. I'm fine with that. And if you're following through, I'm fine with that, you know. But if you just say, oh, we got mad stuff going on, and we don't even hear about what the stuff you got going on, unless it, it didn't work out, then you want to come and post twice a week. And it's like, really? Because, I me, mean, I get, I lose interest very quickly. I lose it very quickly you know so i'm like okay well i mean i know my little view ain't gonna mess up nothing you know what i'm saying but that's my choice i don't i don't want to feel like i'm being played with um you know here's a little video whenever you want to no you got us here you got your main audience to focus on you all this time and now you make it up there you don't got time but then you think okay they got other social media you following them on all the social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and they not doing nothing on there, one of those. And you're like, okay, you're not doing nothing on YouTube, and your Instagram is ghost. And you got thousands and hundreds and millions of followers on Instagram. You ghost. You're not even doing no stories. You're not saying nothing on Facebook. You're not tweeting nothing. Like, what's going on? You know? But... I don't know. I guess people are just, you know, like that. It is what it is, right? So, another thing is, don't share your life with all of us. And then when something happens with your relationship, and your, you know, you want to be like, we want to take this time to be quiet. Or we want to take this time to be private. Uh-uh. If you could show us, push you if you could show your viewers, your audience, of you pushing out a baby, you could at least tell us what's going on with your husband. Like, we not together anymore because we got, you know, we not on the same page. You ain't gotta tell us why you broke up. Just like, you know, we ain't we ain't with it right now. You know, we ain't we ain't on the same page. And I'll be happy with that. I mean, I'm gonna wonder why, but you know, some things I ain't gonna tap too deep in. I'll just, you know, leave it at that. Some don't even do that. I'm like, you you I just saw you push out a whole baby and you wanna tell me. It ain't none of my business what's going on with you and your husband or your boyfriend or your girlfriend. Uh -uh. Mm -mm. I got my window open so you're going to hear outside noise. Okay? All right. So, 
was like, mm, okay, that's how you want to play it? I got you. So then, and then you got people who, they start you out with one type of content, and then when they get bored or they feel like that content is not giving them enough views, they move over to mutt banging. And I don't like that. I don't like to really sit there and watch, watch people eat. I don't. I don't. Now, the people that I know, and I know they do my bangs, I'll probably go in there and be like, hey, you know, that food looks good or whatever, and just to show my support to let you know I'm there and that I'm bouncing. I just don't like to watch people eat. I don't like to watch people brush their dang on teeth on YouTube. I understand you doing a get ready with me or my skincare routine, but I don't want to see you brushing your teeth. I just don't want to see it. Now, if you got a sponsorship going on and you got to use the toothpaste and all that, okay, I'll see sponsorship and I know that's what you're doing. I'll give you a thumbs up, but I'm not going to watch you brush your teeth. I, for some reason, it just irks my nerve. It, watch some, watching somebody brush their teeth is just, mm -mm, I don't like that. I don't. Um, also, sitting there eating food, I, I, don't, I don't like that. You know, I don't. I just don't see the fun in watching somebody eat. Now, there's people who like to watch people eat. I'm just not one of them. Just like you got people who like, there's people who scratch dandruff, you know, in their videos. And people like to see people scratch their dandruff. I don't like to see that, so I'm not going to watch that. Then you got people who like to see them put Ajax in the tub and clean and stuff and squeeze the sponge. That does nothing for me. So, you, there, but there are people out there who love different types of videos, you know. Some people don't want to hear about the news or gossip. So, they probably don't want to watch me. And that's fine. I get it. We're not made for everybody, you know. But it is what it is. But I'm saying that if I'm starting to watch, I started watching you doing, let's say you was vlogging or you was doing hauls or whatever. Or you going on shopping trips. And then all of a sudden, the next 25 videos, are you sitting there eating food? That's not my thing. I'll give you a thumbs up and a heart to let you know I was there, but I'm not going to sit there and watch that. You know? And that's just how I am. I like, you know, when you stop giving me a variety on your channel, it's like saying, okay, you found your audience. Forget everybody else that liked the other stuff that you did. You found your audience. So you're going to roll with that. And if that's how it is, hey, that's fine. Make your money. It is what it is, you know. But I just like variety. I like variety. Sometimes I get bored watching the same old thing over and over and over. I like variety, you know. Um, but, hey, you can't tell people what to do on their page. And another thing I don't like is <laughs> so far it's been so much beefing on YouTube. It's ridiculous. But what I don't like, I don't like when somebody sit there and taunt you on their channel. They will taunt you and taunt you and taunt you and say nasty stuff about you and put have your name all in their mouth. And guess what? As soon as you come into their video or their chat and try to speak your piece on whatever it is, they telling you, oh, what are you doing over here? But you talking about me. You get what I'm saying? How can you expect the person you're talking about not show up when they being called out or they being lied upon or they being talked about? Of course they're going to show up. If they know what's going on, they're going to show up. And you don't give them the opportunity to say what's on their mind on your channel, but you want to talk about them. And you tell them, to get out of here, you're blocked. Don't come over here. You're bullying me. So now you're getting bullied. And there's a lot of people who, a lot of folks that does this crap on YouTube and it's ridiculous. It's like, wasn't you just saying this about somebody and now you want to block them because they, they showed up to your channel and they're trying to clear their name and you don't want that to happen? I don't know. People on YouTube have become very strange. It used to be a place where I used to enjoy a lot of different subjects and a, a lot of different things, but there's just some stuff that I just can't hang with. You know, there's people who I'm mad cool with. And if I don't know what the heck is going on, I'll come through, show you some love, just to let you know I'm there, I'm going to always be there. But I'm bouncing because I don't know what's going on. I hate being lost in the source. 
Shoot, my nosy self wanna know what's 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 going on. Start from the beginning. Let me catch up. <laughs> but um, you know, that's it. It's just some folks on YouTube have just gotten on my last nerve and for me to just have my sanity is either I ain't gonna visit their page or I'll just go over there and see what's going on and you know show my love on some videos and I'm out. You know, doesn't mean that I don't I don't like you or I can't stand you. It doesn't mean any of that. Cause some people I talk to, I talk to a lot of people on Instagram more than I talk to them on on YouTube. It is what it is. But that's my little conversation, you know, to start off the morning, you know. So I just want to just vent to my people, okay. And um, I will talk to y'all later because I do have an article that I read and I just want to talk to you about that. I have that coming up. So you'll be seeing that in probably another two hours, an hour or two. So what time is it now? I don't even know. Maybe around 9 o'clock you'll see that pop up on my channel. All right. So you guys take it easy. I want you all to have a great Friday. Deuces.